Okay, now let's continue with the last uh, type of uh, power electronic switch, and that is the fully controlled switch. With this, uh, we can easily deduce the terminologies. Fully controlled means we can control the turn on as well as the turn off. An example is a no switch. So let's see a simple uh, circuit which implements this MOSFET and we see how uh, we are going to achieve our panel. Okay, so let's see we have a MOSFET which is connected in series with a lamp like this. So if I have a voltage source like this, this one thing we have a, a way of turning it on through the gates. We have the gate, we have the drain, then we have the source. Now we can allow uh, drain current to flow this way, but still, since we don't have any signal at the gate, this switch will remain off, or this power electronic switch over here will remain in the off uh, mode. So, what we can do is that we can now give it a gate voltage. So, when we apply a gate voltage at this point, this switch will turn on, and when it turns on, it will now allow the drain current to flow in the circuit for this lamp to uh, consume the electrical energy. Now, let's see if we can turn this one off. Based on the architecture of this kind of uh, switch, the MOSFET, if I take this switch off, immediately I take it off, then the action that is causing this uh, uh, electrons to flow within the switch it will cease. So all those actions will cease and we will achieve our turn off. So in here you can see that if we want to turn on the device, we give it a drain voltage. And if we want to turn it off too, we take off the drain voltage and we'll be able to achieve both the turn on and turn off by uh, this kind of uh, mechanism. So since we have a control over both turn on and we turn this type of switch as a fully controlled switch. It's not only a MOSFET. We have a lot of switches that fall under these topics. So another example for this fully controlled is the power BDT. So when we start building our circuits, we are going to be employing them one after the other in the application aspects. So that is all for these type of switches. So we meet the next video. Thank you.